What's up, Fortree Nation? Um, so we have some news tonight. And one is a trade. The other is an outright. And then the other is a player with some interest. But before I get into that, if you like this kind of content, baseballs or Yan baseball or Yankees, please hit that uh, like, subscribe, and bell icon buttons. It's greatly appreciated. Very helpful for the channel. And I don't want you to miss out on a single thing that I put out, as well as it gives me great feedback on what you guys think of the content. So let's get on with the news. So the Orioles have acquired left-handed pitcher Cole Irvine from the Oakland A's. Um, it's a good move for them. Gives them another lefty. Gives them another pitcher. I wouldn't be surprised if they went out and got another pitcher. And made another deal for a guy like a uh, Corbin Burns or a Brandon Woodruff. Don't be surprised if they do that. Don't be surprised if they go out and make another splash. I wouldn't uh, count them out on that. Especially after what they did last season. And they're really trying to improve and make, uh, make this team better. And more competitive in the AL East. So don't be surprised if they make another move. And certainly don't count them out for the 2023 season. I have them finishing over Tampa and Boston. Um, <clears throat> so don't count them out. That's going to be a team to watch. That's the dark horse of the American League East. Um, for the uh, player who's drawing interest, it is left-handed reliever uh, Matt Moore. He's most notably known uh, for his years out in Tampa. And uh, everything that he accomplished with Tampa. So he's being looked at by the Boston Red Sox. They have interest in him and they are, and he is drawing some interest from them. And it would be a good fit for him. Now we know the Red Sox are a mess. We know that there's actually no clear direction on where this team is going. And what this team is going to do. So that's just something to keep in mind and... I mean, it could be a good move for them. Nice piece for him. He could end up being good for them if they sign him. Um, I mean, they just acquired Mondesi from the Royals to play short for him. So we really have no clear-cut idea of where this team is going and what direction. I mean, they locked up Devers, but now they got to lock up Verdugo. So to have any chance of having a future for that franchise. But um, that would be something to watch out for. Um, anyways... Uh, Former Yankee farmhand, uh, Justice Sheffield, has been outright to AAA by the Mariners. Uh, this is after coming off a rough year last season uh, with Seattle. And he was one of the Yankees' big prospects. And he was touted to be a, a, uh, a big name in the Yankees' organization. Uh, they actually acquired him uh, in a trade, I believe it was. But he never really panned out, and the Yankees ended up trading him for James Paxton. And now Justice Sheffield has been outrighted to AAA. Uh, let me know what you guys think, and please flood the comments. And uh, let me know your opinions on all of this and everything that's happened. Uh, I will be putting the description in the description below all the links to it. Uh, I will also be putting out a video on the prediction that I have for, for uh, the 2023 standings. So let me know again what you guys think. I enjoy getting into it with you guys. Till next time, have a great rest of your night. Talk to you later. Over and out.